First, squeeze toothpaste out of a tube to brush your teeth. Have you ever crawled through a tunnel to get to the other side? Have you ever blown into a whistle to make a sound? Let's take a look at how we use tubes and tunnels for work and play. When we are thirsty, we can use a tube like a drink and straw to sip our milk. A glass is a tube we use to hold the milk. When we drink a glass of milk, we put our hands around the glass and sip the milk through the straw. A bird feeder is a type of tube that we use to hold seeds for birds to eat. Seeds are loaded into the top of the bird feeder here and birds eat the seeds from the holes in the bottom here. An inner tube is a type of tube we use when we go swimming. It's, it is filled with air that helps it float on the water. It can be fun to float in the tube or lay on top of the tube. A snorkel is a type of tube that helps us breathe under the water. When we swim with a snorkel, the air enters into a tube from above the water, and we breathe into the air through our mouth below the water. Above, below. A play tunnel is a soft fabric tunnel that we can crawl through. When we crawl through the play tunnel together, we need to crawl in the same direction. Otherwise, there will be a traffic jam. This is Sun. Sun is behind Ben in the play tunnel. This is Ben. Ben is in front of Sun in the play tunnel. Ants make their homes by digging tunnels under the ground. The tunnels protect them from the weather and other animals. Here are the tunnels under the ground. The dirt they dig out forms an ant hill over the tunnels. A garden hose is a long, flexible tube that helps us get water to the place where we need it. The children use a hose to wash their red wagon. The child standing far away turns on the spigot, and water travels through the hose. The child who, who is near fills the bucket with soapy water. A saxophone is a type of tube that we can blow air through to create music. If you want to play a saxophone, you first blow air into the mouthpiece. The air travels down the long tuber body of the saxophone. Then music rises up into the air from the saxophone's bell or opening. Can you think of any tubes and tunnels that you use?